So raising the debt ceiling does not increase the debt. How, what do you got there? Hannity Happy Candy. What, what do you come bearing? <laughs> what is that? They're happy. They're happy candies. Um, the reason why I brought these is because the last time. Yeah. The last. You should try one. What They'll make it? you happy because I feel like conservatives are so angry. You know, I mean, right now I'm getting these crazy <laughs> tweets. I can already tell. Oh, I'm You're, laughing my head off. Well, now. last time, and, and you know, maybe I think this is a proper opportunity for you to apologize, not to me, but to the viewers, for taking, taking your your attack personally. Really? And instead, well, we should have a say? conversation. Well, he said something about shut my mouth and know my role. So <laughs> I think that that maybe you should take these happy candies. Are they loaded with drugs or anything? Well, I am from, from her. They are. I am from Colorado, and they do. They they are now oh, legal. No, oh, but this is but this is fake one. Well, you should try it. No. But but I think that we owe it to the viewers no. to to talk about the issues Can and I ask not you, be so right, angry. Now that this is, this is speech over, how does not how does raising the debt ceiling not increase the debt? That was my question. Well. It doesn't. How not? Because we're getting... <laughs> Wait, I needed a happy candy. No, because we're... <laughs> I didn't even eat one. Go ahead. Finish it. Because we're paying, uh. we're paying old debt that we owe, like people who, who have pensions oh and all God. of these things that are already required, this prior debt. Yes, you, you need many. Don't. Does it smell like marijuana? No. no. Okay, good. All right. um, but, but the problem is, is that the conservatives are stuck on... You're, you're playing two speeches. Bush increased the debt limit eight times. Was it eight times while he was president? Did you eat a lot of this before no, but, you came but, out here? But let's talk about this. Wasn't it eight times, Sean? Right, listen, let me, listen, let me listen, educate right, you. Let, it was eight times. Let me educate you. And President Obama only, yeah. ob only objected to that one time, and you're focused on it. Billy this Cunningham. woman has lost her mind. There's no question about that. Let me yeah. help you with math. When your friend Obama took office, the national debt was about nine and a half to ten trillion. Now it's 17 on its way to 20. In my simple Catholic grade school math, that's about a ten trillion dollar increase on an eight year of Obama. Is 20 greater than 10, Tamara? Earth to Tamara is 20 greater than 10. Tamara? Are you talking to me like I'm an alien? I'm no. Or because I didn't go to Catholic school? I mean, you don't look like a Catholic well, girl. Well, what, what Bill Cunningham's saying is His by the time. Comments, he, are you listening to this, Sean? Can I do, what did he say? I don't look like a Catholic girl. What do I look like? What do I look like? Oh, Fair boy. or false at wannabe? be. Right, can I just ask a question? If the president I do you accept this? this? He is your typical conservative, bashing people, bashing me for my I've lost opinions. lost all control. Farrah no, Fawcett. What's that, wrong with Farrah Fawcett? Farrah Fawcett, Fawcett was beautiful. Farrah Fawcett wannabe, yeah. Catholic schoolgirl, or whatever. I don't look like right, that. Can I, can I ask but, a but question? No, this is the problem with your show and with Americans and people like Bill Cunningham. It's always an attack, an attack on the president, all right, an can we go back to on the, can, people. Hang on a sec. Can I go back to the question? He will have doubled the debt of every president before him. By t the math is right. 10 trillion to 20 trillion, he will have doubled our debt in eight short years. Every president before him, all their debt accumulated, he will have the exact same debt. No. But, okay. The no, truth will set true. you, you're, it you're is not enslaved. True. You and, are and enslaved. What, wait, what are we going to go to then? What, what is the concern? Billy Cunningham. What we do is because go to a five-year balance budget. Rand Paul has it right. When I listen to Fox oh, Business Paul, this morning, Fox Business Rand said Paul it right. This morning, $200 trillion dollars unfunded liabilities. Your ilk, people Get of your, your ilk. your finger out of my face. People of your ilk, basically, are going to ruin this country. This is a predictive people catastrophe. People of my ilk? You mean ilk. the youth of America? Not the, the youth, youth of America. Liberal Democrats. This is a predictive disaster coming our way, and you're playing games with it. Hannity and I know it's not a game. People like you are helping to destroy this country fiscally. We can't. Grow we, up. The, you not, not, uh, I, grow I, up? Grow it's up. Not, it's 90 trillion in unfunded liabilities. Add that to the debt that we have. How do we sustain that? How do we sustain it? We yeah. do. We cut spending and we increase taxes because the Bush tax cuts, they didn't work. They didn't work. He said he was going to create two and a half million jobs or, or five million. He only created two and a half million. His policies didn't work. And you want to go back to something that put us in a hole. He, well, it put us in a hole. Lord, you live in some alternative No, I universe. don't, because guess what? I didn't vote for Obama the second time, but he won again. Why? Why? Because, because too many people get government benefits no. at someone else's right. cost. No, because the conservatives are terrible. No, they're not. You, you have no platform at all. all right, I you have no go. way to speak to the youth, and all you do are call names. That's it. When we come You're back. next year.
Hannity Happy Candy. I'm going to guzzle this. 